I am at the house. Um, so I just want to kind of show you how I built a cheap, simple little shelf to kind of throw you some extra wood up on top of. And I'm going to kind of show you the tools and everything you're going to need. But I had a bunch of extra wood laying around. And that's from the deck that we built right there. And uh, I'll show you a big pile of wood we got just laying over here. There's all a couple extra pieces of wood we got just laying around. But uh, what I've done, I took me a few pieces of just some of this deck board like this. That's what I have for my you know the deck board and me and my daughter Gracie we built a little birdhouse yesterday all that stuff just kind of gave us a little fun thing to do so I try to recycle that stuff and just use as much as I can get every little penny that I paid for it out of it but uh here you go I'll show you a little cheap little shelf and kind of little tips and tricks that you can do um when I went by my wood if you look they use these pieces of wood at like Lowe's or Home Depot to strap the big bundles together and that right there, that little slot right there is where that strap goes through. And um, they usually have that stuff just laying around. They pretty much give it to you. So I took it and I had probably at least a half a truckload because I got a bunch of it. Just every time I went up there, I just got me a, a good armload of them and took them out with me. They just give them to me for free. So that's what I've done. I recycle that stuff and I built me some shelves out of it. Uh, what I had, bought me a little Dewalt set. It's a four-piece set, comes with an impact and the saws all, some two batteries, a charger, flashlight, and just a regular drill. Um, but this is all I used on this stuff today. Just got me a sawzall, put me a wood blade on there, my impact to screw my screws into, your tape measure, your square, pencil, and your level. Um, what I've done, I just came out with this top piece right here, 24 inches. And then I used the, the extra I had left over. Just held it up there, drew me a line straight across of where I can make my angle there. And then on the back side, I just kind of left it where it just went down that way. And then I just screwed it all together. And I built me three going all the way down through there. And that's about roughly, I don't know, maybe about 100 inches, somewhere around there, between one end to the other. And that'll hold your, you know, 12 foot stuff, 16 foot stuff. And it's pretty sturdy because you got all your weight is going to be right here. And it's going to be pressing down on it right there. And I pretty much, I can put all my body weight. That's what I'm doing right now. I'm just hanging here. Put all my body weight there and it don't go nowhere. Because all the weight is pressing down right there. And it's going to go to them screws right here. And it ain't going to go nowhere. So it's pretty sturdy. Something cheap and easy to do. I'm going to show you guys how to just kind of make you something cheap. And it don't take a lot of knowledge to do this stuff. So. But that's it. Um, if you got any questions, just let me know.